Hello fellow Peanuts fans, I'm Karen from CollectPeanuts.com. Today we have a mystery box. I'm not sure what's inside other than it says towels, cards, and Hallmark. A fellow collector sent this to me. Thanks to you, Roger. And we're gonna get this open today. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and if you can do a little bit more, join us on Patreon.com. There's a link in the description down below. Let's get started. All right, on top we have a towel and it's got some major condition issues here. So I may be able to get this out. Uh, I do have a video on my channel showing how I've turned browned towels looking bright white again. So be sure to check that out. This towel is brand new. Looks really good on the backside. And I can tell it's brand new because it still has the price tag. Looks like it was just $1.80 back in the day. This is probably from the 1970s. Let's see, it looks like there's a, another couple of towels here. We've got Snoopy in his nightgown holding a candle. This one says, happiness is settling down for a long winter's nap. This one's also brand new. And also, oh my, we have Peppermint Patty and Snoopy here. And this one says, a kiss on the nose does much toward turning anger aside. And on the back here, we got Snoopy and Woodstock. Adorable. <laughs> This poor thing is going to need a little bit of TLC. But look at this, guys. Oh, my goodness. It's a promotion from a boy named Charlie Brown, which is the first feature film for Peanuts. Uh, yeah, this is, this is going to need a lot of work. I'm probably just ironing. It's probably not a big deal. It looks like it's... Uh, like a violet color. I never see this color, so I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I never see purple or violet in these pennants. So that is amazing. I love that. Wow, there's a lot more than Hallmark in this box, guys. We have, well, these are Hallmark. These are gift trims from Hallmark. Looks like I have some extras here. So be sure to keep an eye on the shop at collectpeanuts.com so you can get some of these for your own collection. Got some out of the package here. Yes, these are basically just a sheet of stickers. Oh, we've got more greeting cards, guys. I'm gonna go through these pretty quick because if, if I go through them individually, um, <laughs> read you all these cards. It's gonna take a long time. Actually, this one looks really cute. Oh, yeah. Look at that, guys. And if you want to see uh, pictures of some of these cards, um, I take snapshots of interesting parts. Oh, this is a book and I post them on my Instagram. So definitely go check that out. I'm at collect peanuts over there. Oh, look at all these bright colored envelopes. Wow. There's a green one too. Valentine's day. Make the scene with green. Oh, it's St. Patrick's day. This this one is super bright. You know I love the super bright ones. Got a nice Easter one here. Love that bunny. Charlie Brown for Easter. Easter one. Love those ears on Snoopy. Couple of these. So one of these will be going into the shop. Oh, look at that. I love this look on Snoopy. Oh, that's a good one too. Lucy, a happy birthday brother card. Snoopy, another Easter. 
about you at Easter? My jelly beans taste flat. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder what's so great about this crazy world. And then I think of you. Happy Easter. <laughs> it doesn't seem like a very Eastery card, but you know, it's early days, early days. I love when they've got this like, uh, the puffiness to them. I should know what that's called. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh no. What is going on there? It says, of course I missed your birthday. What did you expect from today's irresponsible, uninformed youth? Hope it was happy. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love it so much. Let's see, we got a newspaper here. Daily TV news. We've got a, a Charlie Brown Thanksgiving on here. What What is happening here with Woodstock's eyes? They appear to be down here. <laughs> Eyes up here, Woodstock. Eyes up here. We have a peanuts portfolio here from party time, just 49 cents. Very cute. This is by Plymouth. And we also have, oh, we got two here. They're like intertwined. Here we go, here we go. We've got this lovely number. I like the composition notebook look. We got Snoopy doing the dart bike thing there. I think it's probably the same in the back, yep. And this Peanuts portfolio, look at that. I spy with my little eye some party napkins. You call this peanut butter sandwich a party? Look at that. I, I wish I could go to that party. Just so I could say that line and then yum down that peanut butter sandwich. And some football napkins here. Some golfer napkins. And wee! <laughs> Then we have some, what are these? Plans a party. These look like, oh, these are three table tallies for Progressive Bridge. Whatever that means. I don't play bridge. Nobody's played bridge since the 70s, I'm pretty sure. Wow, wow, wow. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, there's another layer underneath this. I, I can't, I can't believe I have one of these in the package. This is from a Hallmark store. How about that? This is a Snoopy stainless steel spoon. And this is made by Determined Productions. So that's interesting. Matching fork. Look at that. Let's, let's put them side by side here. Let's get the, the full cutlery look. That is beautiful. Okay, we've got name tags from Hallmark. Very cute. <laughs> There's so much good stuff in here. I don't know where to go next. But uh, I picked the brightest thing. Hot, hot, hot pink. Postalettes. Ah, uh, there's probably stickers in here that say, hi there. They go right in here. It's, it's just so beautiful. Look, look, at, look at that image. Look at that. It's great. Old Ratchet Jaw Lives. That, that's a reference I do not get at all. I just, I just want to show you these relics of the past. Probably definitely 1970s because I think that's when the, the CB thing was really big. All right, a little something different here. We've got a coin purse. This is also from Hallmark. 
So cute. I want like a big poster t-shirt like that. I'll probably end up with a, a t-shirt. That would be great. 10 note cards. These are also Hallmark. I've seen these before. Clackers. That's what these are called. I think, I think these are used. So I'm going to, I'm going to demonstrate with this one. It's got some damage on it. And No. Is that it? Is that it? Please let me know in the comments what, what this is supposed to do. Um, anyway, this is a giveaway from Weber's Bread back when they try to get you to buy lots of bread and they get, did giveaways. Remember those days when there were incentives to buy things? Rather than just fueling capitalism? Anyway, <laughs> you're Snoopy. And Linus, I believe these came out in two sizes. And then another Lucy. And of course, as you can imagine, there is a Charlie Brown. I believe I have pictures of these on my website if you want to check them out. And we also have a tattoo book here. It is very difficult to see. It's still in the package. I'm not taking it out. I've shown these in previous videos, so go go watch all my previous videos, like and subscribe, you know. All right, back to the gift trim. This is a beautiful piece. Oh, it's from Hallmark, of course. They make such great things, but the really standout part of this is it's fuzzy. The green is fuzzy. I, I hope that's coming in on, on the camera. If not, I, I believe I have at least one of these in my shop, so get them for your own gift package. Back to the note cards. Here we have notes and seals. Again, you get these stickers to go on these notes from Hallmark. Oh, there's no, there's no diagram on the back. Just use your imagination. Oh, there's... Notes and envelopes. So you probably seal the envelopes with the stickers. I love surprises. Curse you, Red Baron. Now I don't want to open this too much because you can see that it hasn't really been used. I want to keep it nice, preserve it. Oh yeah, you can see all the different letters where you can organize all your people's there is some info on the back here. This is a bit of a mystery. I think this is by a company that did, I, I want to say they're called like A&M Leather Lines or something. They did dust pads and letter holders. I'm thinking that's who did this, but I'm not really sure. We have a sticker here. This was also a giveaway for bread. These cute little stickers. I don't remember this one. We've got a lot more uh, gifty things. <laughs> Gift decor. Oh, oh, we got another clacker. Okay, we've got Charlie Brown here. This is Hallmark. Oh, yeah, there we go. Now you don't have to go to collectpeanuts.com to see Charlie Brown. There he is. Oh, this one says Dolly Madison Cakes. Oh, that probably makes it worth more. Because <laughs> everybody loves Dolly Madison, but everybody's like, Weber's bread? What was that? Oh, we've got a patch. This is also from Interstate Brands that does Dolly Madison and Weber's bread. Inexpensively made. I don't know how long it would last. Got a Snoopy riding a hobby horse. Classic Joe Cool here with the Frisbee. Graduation Snoopy. Love that. We've got Snoopy dancing. And finally, we've got a pin pal here. I don't know why there's tape on the top of it. That's unfortunate, but I love to see this in the package. As you can tell down here, it is by Aviva. Oh, hey. <laughs> There's another Linus. 
Oh, there's another Lucy. And another Lucy. So if you if you want to give uh, one of these clackers a try, I'm definitely going to have some in the shop. Oh, we've got a keychain here. I smell a wet pilot. And on the reverse side, we've got Snoopy in the rain. This is by Aviva. You don't see these too often. I've been sta oh, I've been staring at this box. Hey, guess who said A&M leather lines and wasn't sure about it? Look what I see. Yes. My memory is not failing me. Let's look inside. Oh. Yes, there we go. Snoopy come home. This is a big tablet of paper, I believe. Now this, this doesn't mean that the address book is also A&M leather lines. Um, I don't see any similarities between these two other than kind of the form and the application, if that makes any sense. Hopefully, <laughs> they both do uh, office supplies. So that's what makes me think that this adder's book might be A&M Leather Lines. Also, this does not say on the item itself who made it. Back at the postalettes, we've got a lovely little Valentine's Day design here. Love these. Those, those are just so cute. Yet another sticker. Oh, this uh, Snoopy Beetle's got one I actually see quite a bit of. Oh, we've got a Redwood Empire Ice Arena patch. This is the ice arena that Charles Schultz built in Santa Rosa, California. Definitely go check that out if you're a big Peanuts fan. I don't remember this color scheme. I thought it was a different color than this. I, I'm, I'm going to have to look at other things. Also, it's very interesting that it says 1969 CMS Charles Monroe Schultz rather than UFS. So that's an oddity. We've got some Snoopy playing cards here. These are from the 1970s. We've got a bigger deck of playing cards, just, just to give you an idea. I have never seen this. It's, it's a pencil topper. It's Snoopy in a mailbox pencil topper. Okay, we're going for the yo-yos. Wow. <laughs> this blows my mind. Guys, it's in the package. The package is in great condition. Oh, another hummingbird yo-yo. I don't know what that means. You know, for a person that's like, oh, I love the yo-yos, I don't know anything about them. This one needs a, a little more TLC, but look at that. I don't, I don't know that I've ever found one of these hummingbird yo-yos in the wild. Now, the, the yo-yos I usually find are this sort where they're very rounded on the edge. Oh, another hummingbird. Got a Snoopy sleeping on a yo-yo there. Another champion yo-yo. I definitely have one of these in my collection. Oh, another pin pal. Nice. We have Snoopy the firefighter there. Oh, yeah, this poor Snoopy. Oh, what happened to you, Snoopy? What happened to you? Oh, he, he's very dirty. I'm going to go wash my hands. It's got like kind of that iridescent sheen in some places. It's very weird. I'm going to have to try and restore him. Unless you think Chocolate Snoopy should just be left as Chocolate Snoopy. It, it looks so weird. Peanuts Notepad. Congrats on making it through another day. We, we all need that. Uh, Hallmark, bring that back out. Snoopy Seals. So cute. I, I think my favorite is probably that one. And we've got Snoopy Dancing on a Star. This is uh, for a a package, I believe. It matches some wrapping paper I have from Hallmark. That is really cute. I love that. Uh, some peanut seals. Vote no for dog catcher. Get some 
vinyl stickers. Beagle Power. Love that. Snoopy for president. Oh, oh. <laughs> Vote. The only thing we have to fear is cats. And I'll put a color TV in every doghouse and a pizza in every pot. I don't, I don't know if I want pizza after it's been in a pot, but you know, you do you. Seals for Halloween here. Snoopy belt buckle from Aviva. There we go. You would attach that to a belt of some sort. And the final piece in this bucket is this. <laughs> what is this? What is this? Of all the things I need you to tell me in the comments, what this is, is the biggest thing I need to know. We have a Snoopy radio here in the original box. It needs to be put back together a bit better, but... Ooh, look at how fresh that is. Wow, look at that, so good. It still has the original headphones. We have a Charlie Brown jigsaw here. Love these, you know I do puzzle videos. If not, go check those out. Uh, I don't know where to put things anymore. We've got Snoopy walking. There were quite a few Snoopy puzzles in this. I think these are Milton Bradley. Yep, it says Milton Bradley at the very, very bottom there. And we've got a Linus. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> Ooh! Rah! I, I have never seen this before. This says it is a fun fan. And this is by Springbok, a division of Hallmark. <laughs> There's so many surprises in this box. That is amazing. I love it. Uh, I, ho I hope I find more, but I'm running out of boxes, so this might be the last one in existence. If you have one of these in your collection, please reach out. We have some Valentine's Day napkins here. It's a, a little bit of TLC, but I think we'll get that back to normal. And envelopes. <laughs> uh, these, these all appear to be empty. But you know I'm going to have to go through and just double check. Yeah, this started coming apart in the box. Oh, I've never seen this either. Peanuts notebook dividers and labels. These labels fell out. So we can show these to you. Look at those. Man, I wish I had these in school. Now you can see all the different dividers that are in there. I'm not taking this out of the package because this, this bag is um, falling apart and I wanna keep everything together for as long as possible and as close to the original as possible. We have some more postulettes. See, th these look like baseball. Oh, I wish, I wish, this could be just a little bit further down. Great pumpkin cookie cutter. Ooh, you don't see this one a lot. This one is by Hallmark. Oh, look what we have. Oh, oh no. This is like a, um, cellophane sheet or something that goes over the top you can um, cut it out and use it uh, window mirror or lampshade but luckily this one is still in card form and it has an envelope stuck to the inside we will take care of that later wow this is a big card look at that Aww. oh another peanuts telephone dial plate 
Uh, I've got I've got another one of these somewhere. So look for one of these in the shop. You never see these though. You're gonna, I'm gonna have to get a dial telephone just to put one of these on. More name tags here. More peanut seals. This time for Halloween and Valentine's Day. What is this called? Oh, this is a gift trim. Some seals. Do we see these before? I can't. Oh, uh, this is not going to be peanuts, but I love these. So we're going to we're going to show you this. Uh -huh. OK, I'm keeping that. Got to love a good honeycomb pumpkin. Here's another CB reference. And the great thing about this one, on the back is all the CB jargon. How great is that? Now you don't have to go look it up on Google. I, I love the backgrounds of these with the like quilted East work. Look at this one. <laughs> love it. Some St. Patrick's Day. This is hilarious. <laughs> And again, it's got the jargon on back. Got a Peanuts graduation home decoration book. This has punch outs for uh, graduation. I won't flip through it too much because these can be very delicate. St. Patrick's Day seals. And just so you know, seals are just stickers. They just call them that. We got some Easter here. <laughs> Oh, Snoopy with a wishing well. Don't see that. Look at this Snoopy. Got kind of a colonial Washington look there. Just for you. Of a little Charlie Brown here. Very cute. Look at that. Another one in that same style. Well, thanks for joining us here for this mystery box today of all sorts of different Peanuts things. And of course... This, this guy, who is he? Let me know. <laughs> Maybe nobody knows. Oh, well, uh, like this video, subscribe to the channel, help us out on Patreon, and come visit us at collectpeanuts.com where you can see photos of my collection, buy something for your own collection, and of course, read lots of articles about collecting peanuts. It's in the name. Happy collecting, everyone. Bye. This is a lot of stuff. <laughs> I got my work cut out for me tonight. Oh, boy. But first...